Playing uh, the Elusive World E from Super Mario Advance 4. In one second, I just gotta restart this thing. Hey, just, just hit reset. I'm gonna play the game opening too, since, you know. I mean, I could be playing Mario Advance 4 as a game stream, but it's not something I'll be doing anytime soon or anything, because. Like, it's just Mario 3. I don't really have reason to play this version over, like, All-Star since... I mean, I don't know. It's a good version, but I just don't play it. Because I haven't played it in, like, ages. So I'm just not used to this one. Bro, look at Toad go. So I'm guessing each of the kingdoms has their own toad, actually. I can't produce uh, evil Koopa Leech just ready chaos all across the world. Please help! Sincerely, Toad! Bro, they got a new peach sprite. It's different from the one in Mario 3 and All-Stars, because I guess, you know, that was just a Mario 2 sprite. I kind of like this one. It's cute. But it also looks a little different from the art style of Mario 3, so... I don't know. Either way, pretty cool stuff. Oh wait, I forgot to make it full screen. But, not a big deal. I had some controller issues, but I sorted that out. Anyway, let's go do level card. Oh yeah, Classic World 1-1. I forgot they had that in here, because that isn't one of the things I did for... My frickin' World E series on Mario Maker 2. Cause like, it's just Mario 1-1. One, one. This isn't really particularly special. But the brick sounds are pretty cool. I guess it is pretty cool playing this level with like, Mario 3 physics. Just, how do you know the 1-Up is here? They don't have any background. Just what I needed! Okay, you know what? Actually, that's the reason this is a good version. Done. Bruh, what is that Starman theme? I like the custom, like, ground tiles they have here. They look a bit different from the Mario All-Stars ones. I can tell. I forgot the bonus music in my Mario Maker 2 levels. What's wrong with me? Wait, that's it? Wow. Oh. You just... Okay. Interesting. Bruh. That's so sad. It's just Is it like finding the freaking last box in Crash Games? I'm guessing it's like that. Bruh, I like how Mario did like a little flip. That that animation looked kind of sick. Oh, it has a little mark if you do it for Mario and Luigi. I'm gonna do it for everyone with each character. Screw it. I'm gonna just play World E again. But switch the characters next time. Um... 
I wish they added vegetables in Mario Maker 2. Like, they added Mario 2 Mario, but they they didn't add vegetables to go with it. Like, that would have been perfect. Like, just pick stuff out of the ground. It would have been easy to implement. You just put it in the top of the ground layer and you, your level, and that's it. Oh, wait, crap. How do I pick Luigi? Um, oh, wait, I remember now. Wait, no, huh? Luigi. Okay, that's how you pick a Luigi. Bruh, sad. Yeah, it's even worse than Sapiro. Me, when I'm trying to find the last purple coin in Mario Odyssey levels. Do -do 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 -do. Also, unlike Mario 3, Luigi actually has a unique physics in this one. So he feels all floaty and high jumpy. He has the same properties in the main game as well if you want to play as Luigi in Mario Advance 4. Pretty cool stuff. I'd say it's worth getting Mario Advance 4 alone. You can play as Luigi. There's a new world exclusive to this version. Bruh, Luigi's sprite is the only one that's, like, mad bright. Everyone else looks normal. Why? Why did they do that? Okay, here he doesn't look bright anymore. They look much better with gloves. Bro, he feels... Honestly, Luigi feels a lot floatier than he normally would in 2D Mario games, too. Like, he's, he has high jumps, but, like... I don't know why, but they, they just... Decided to make him mad floaty. I know I'm saying- Oh! They actually added coins there. That's not in the regular version of the Mario 1 level. See? There's a small difference. Not a big one, but it's a, it's a difference. Well, I meant more so, um... The, the regional coins from Mario Odyssey, but yeah. That too. I like how they decided to use the green piranhas, dude. That's like Mario 1. Oh yeah, wait. I wonder what happens if you go in the warp zone here. They did something else. No, bro, those platforms look sick. Um, I'm gonna go to a world... Um, Oh! You get a little item thing, I guess. I can't do the rewind thing like I can on... I'm, I'm used to Switch Online right now. Gotta get used to this. Honestly, I actually really like this version of Mario 3. Why? wonder why I didn't play- eh! I mean, I had a reason not to play this one, because I just wanted to play All-Stars, but... Still, this is really cool, actually. The screen crunch isn't even bad, either. Like... Usually, that's a little bit of an issue for these versions, but... No. You can see basically everything. Ah, 
interesting. I like how they did both level ending thing. Oh, okay, so there's only one coin here. I want to find all the, the E coins as well. And the Ace coins. It'll be a hard task, but... Also, I'd be able to exactly tell you which of the levels I was able to make in Mario Maker 2, and which ones I am not. Just what I needed. Wow, it sounds like the All-Stars version, but also like its own version. It's pretty cool sounding. Crap. No. I wanted to beep out. You know what? No. Just do it again. What if I just left the level, got a power-up, left it again? It saves your power-up, so... Yeah. I could do that. This version's pretty fun. No! Bro, I, I suck at Mario. Eh, no reason to really use save states that much, honestly, though. Other than stuff like that. The good thing is, I know where a lot of the secrets are, because I, you know, I did them in Mario Maker. So, HA! Oh, well, a good chunk of these levels. Only the ones I was able to, like... No, I want to see what happens to Bowser. I keep freaking forgetting what I'm doing. Oh crap, wait, my computer isn't plugged in. That's not good. Gotta plug it back in, hold up. I gotta charge that thing. While I'm doing my stream. Okay, well, good thing I realized. Okay, now I can get the fire flower. I like how smooth the rotation is on this right. Haha, -ha, just what I needed. Just gotta stabilize this a little bit. Ah, you know what? Screw you. How do you even use those? Oh, I see. Don't know why they- actually, I know why they chose two two. Bro, why is the music so much faster? By the way, how loud is the sound for you? Can you hear the music really well? I'm guessing it's fine. Bro, the music's so much faster than the All-Stars version. It sounds like it has the freaking timer. Do do do. Doom, 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 doom,
ドゥンドゥンドゥルンドゥンドゥンドゥンドゥルン They don't have the freaking turbulence on the bottom. Ruined. Oh yeah, I forgot how ugly Mario 3 Underwater was in like Mario Maker. This just reminds me of that because like the freaking weird ugly block things. Not the donuts, those are cute, but like the the gray wall thing. Do 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 Where's the frickin' ace coin, anyway? Wait, what? Okay, I'll look it up. Oh, somehow I didn't see that coin. Might as well just do it with Luigi, it wouldn't be any different, he doesn't swim differently. Actually, I know why I didn't see it, because of the freaking camera. Yeah, I was down here, so... I missed it completely. Fair enough. But still a no- No, Luigi! Working on Mario 1 levels for like 10 minutes here. Now it's cool that you get to see how they're a little bit different from the All-Stars version slash just Mario 1. And then you'll get to see another version of Mario 1 again in Versus SMB. <laughs> They remove most of the one-ups in Versus SMB, I believe. Like, the ones you find hidden. I like how they use spiny cheap cheap so it's kinda cool, I guess. There. Bruh, I like how the water came off of him when he went out of the pipe. That's kind of cool. Damn it. Yeah, hey. Nah, just the first five levels. Just as a neat bonus. Now, this is where it gets crazy. Mario... Oh well, yeah, what was I saying? I don't even know. Oh yeah, I gotta keep playing as Luigi. Bald ride in the sky. 
I want to see if I can find all the coins on my own, honestly. Oh yeah, I don't think I could do this one in Mario Maker, I don't know. Because there's too much vertical camera movement. Bro, oh, this feels like Mario 3. Oh yeah, I just thought of it, but I'm too used to freaking being able to crouch as small ma Mario, like in Mario Maker 2. Damn, I keep dying. This level's kinda hard. Oh yeah, also, I should just read the descriptions on all the cards. Just for fun, as part of the little thing that we can do with the, the world E levels. Okay, so 1-1. One, one. See where all of Mario and Luigi's ventures began. Find the first ever 1-Up mushroom. Within the original... Uh, wait, um... If this sort of level is impossible too, we'll be unbeatable for sure, bro. Why are they saying that about 1-2? Okay, um, one, three. If you don't jump high enough, you won't be able to grab the top of the flap pole. True. One, four. Mario must be paralyzed with fear, should he know what's ultimately awaiting him. Classic, two, two. Yeah, this good old tune. Still, though, are you going to have some time to listen and enjoy it? <laughs> Bruh. Wild, okay, wild one in the sky. This level. Take a wild ride in the sky. Think you can have all the coins? Not if Bullet Bill has anything to say about it. Just acting scared will get you left behind in the sky. Do your best. I like the little descriptions on the e-reader cards. Oh gosh, this is kind of fast. No, okay, well. Damn it. Bro, this level is hard. Oh crap, they want me to use a Koopa shell here. Oh wait, or not. I like the little coins, they're fun. Bro. This is crazy. Oh wait, whoa, 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 the camera became non-scrolling. Okay, that's another reason I couldn't do this. Because I'm pretty sure- Bro, what the hell are those bullet pills? Oh wait, aren't those in Super Mario World? I forget. Oh no! No, and there is no checkpoints because this is Mario 3! Bro. Bro, this is insane. Okay. Um... Crap, what do I do? Yeah, it's actually pretty hard. I'm gonna get, just get free power up. Screw it. Frickin' wild right in the sky. They were right about that. If I had to do this in Mario Maker, if it was possible, I mean, it would take me a while. I'm just gonna cheat it, because they let you do that. Do 
Whoa, 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 no, ow, god, okay, this, I gotta start using safe states now, don't I? Okay, I'm getting a bit better at it. Crap! No! Damn it. Bro, this is the first, like, actual level, other than the Mario 1 levels, and it's crazy. I feel like this was them wanting to make an original Mario on the GBA, but they didn't get you, so they just made a bunch of levels for Mario 3 instead. That's pretty cool, honestly. This is like a mini Mario adventure, almost. Like, there's 30 different levels. That's quite a lot. For all the new content you get out of it. If I'm playing Mario Advance 4, I'm gonna do a Luigi playthrough of the main game, because, you know, he's actually different in this one. Bro, the camera bobbing is getting me. Bro. Ah. all the way back here. The floaty jumps is kind of a judgment, honestly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure New Super Mario Brothers was originally Super Mario Advanced 5, but, and this was, like, their way of, like, at least getting ready for that, because, like, they, they actually made original levels, so, like, maybe all their experience with, like, making the other, like, Mario Advanced games made them want to make a new 2D Mario. That's what I think happened, anyway. Pretty sure. That's how it went. Same thing with Donkey Kong Country. There, there was supposed to be Donkey Kong Country 4 for the DS. Or so Rare said, anyway. They wanted to make another Donkey Kong Country because of their skills with making the games again on the GBA. That would have been a pretty cool timeline, I gotta say.
Yep. Okay, that was an insane level. Sliding the slopes. Oh yeah, this one's in my Mario Maker thing. I'll make sure to note a couple changes as I play through it too. Because I'll notice all the differences. I know my life. Okay, first of all, I didn't do it in night because, well, um, because the night theme changes all the freaking like physics and stuff. Also, bro, what the? Sadly, there's no way to disable that. Oh, God. Okay. Bro. That jump is a lot harder in Mario Maker. I don't know. Um. What else? Oh yeah, I wasn't able to do these frickin' triangular Mario World blocks, so I used vines to so just get across the map. And I put a spring right there. Cool stuff. Not as fun, but... Yeah, it would've been nice to get another uh, rare. It's like better 3, because we still did get DKC4, but we didn't get another one from rare. Bro, this is so much funner than my Mario Maker version. In that part, and anyway. I'm sad I couldn't do the triangle blocks. Okay, we got this buzzy shell. Oh yeah, red, red parrot Goombas. No pile driver micro Goombas. And, I mean, Pile Driver, I mean, the freaking Goom Paragoomba with the babies. That's not in Mario Maker. What else is different in my level? I don't know. I like how they have a e reader thing here. Other than that, I was pretty faithful, I gotta say. Cool level. Yeah, it is pretty cool. Yeah, a lot of them have, like, elements from other of the Mario games. So they all, they all actually feel pretty distinct. This one, not in Mario Maker, not in my Mario Maker 2 thing, because no vegetables. You can't do vegetable volley without freaking, bro, what the, this level's crazy. Bro, that's kind of cool. What the heck? Okay, um... That was kind of cool. Oh god, what the, what the heck? <laughs> Bro. <laughs> you know what? Screw Mario Maker. This was a big, like, crossover before that. Like, having enemies in different game styles is cool. But, like, like this is the real deal right here. Damn it. Gotta get that mushroom. Mario Maker doesn't feel as crazy now, but like when it came out, it was like, wow, look at all the enemies and the styles. And here it's just crazy, because you're like, what the heck, I'm charging Chuck in Mario 3. Trill. And vegetables from Mario 2. Oh, God, what the? Okay, you know what? Screw you, Chuck. Can I kill him? Like in Mario World? Ah, oh, damn it. No, well, I probably just end up getting a fire flower in this level anyway. I like how you can get coins, too. Hey, I think that's the same sound effect as the, um... Whatchamacallit. The star coins, and then it's a... Bro! 
They even got the thing for Mario Advance 1. The giant vegetables, because they were like, you know what, let's add freaking giant vegetables. That'll make the game different. I mean, it did. Doesn't change a lot, but they're they're kind of funny. Ah, oh, damn it. I like how Luigi just like yeah. He's really putting his all into every vegetable. Oh wow, this is really cool. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. Is there a big vegetable here? Of course, there's always a poison mushroom. Bro. Wait, 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 hold up. Damn it, I hate these guys. They're even more annoying here. Okay. I like how they have, like, actual clapping sounds. That's kind of cool. Bro, this is so unique. They're, like, jumping. They're not even... Bro! This is crazy! Okay, I got that one. I, I like this a lot. Okay, kill him. Kill him. How's the game volume? Is it loud? Or quiet enough, but... I'm not too loud over the music. I don't know. Coins. Oh wow. The big no. Yeah, I know, right? Oh my god, you lose all your coins. No. Okay. Bro, I hate you. You lose all the e coins. Okay, good. Bro, screw you. Frickin' chain shop. When I was little, we used to call them chomp chomps. Bro, I like how they're like, or oh, or. Oh. Wait, I can kill them with fire? I don't think you can do that in Super Mario World. Bro. Okay, this is sick. I know you could kill them with the cave, but... Bro, the frickin' poison mushroom, too. This truly is Super Mario 3, the lost levels. But good. Okay, there's definitely a... No, wait, no, screw you. There's definitely a coin in one of these. Oh. Don't kill me. God, God damn it. Okay, I should make a safe state, but I'm having too much fun.
I'm having too much fun. I don't want to make safe states. Uh. Okay, the levels are fun, but they can also be kind of hard. At least for little old baby me, I don't know. I'm a little baby man. Bad at Super Mario, apparently. Yeah, actually, I'm pretty good at Mario. I'm just... I don't know, I never played these levels. Properly, anyway. My only experience is my fake Mario Maker version. That charging shock right there can screw off. Oh, I don't remember that. Charging shock sucks. This little... Yeah. I like how you get one-ups if you get them all. Oh, bruh. Okay, so you do remember some of these levels. Uh, Treacherous Holes is pretty cool, honestly. I just feel like my Mario Maker level didn't do it justice. Personally, I thought slip sliding away was the worst. Also, there's like something called like Tower of Fear or something. The, the tower one. That one was really hard. Oh wait, Treacherous Halls is the one that was a speed run. That one was pretty hard in the Mario Maker one. It might be easier here though. But yeah, I did at least a good two thirds of them. Of the ones I was able to create. Okay, time to switch to Mario. Oh wait, I already did. Doors of Plenty. That's a good one. Okay, good. I was thinking of something else, bro. bro. I even got the ghost house music. I'd say my Mario Maker version of this was pretty much spot on, for the most part. I like how they got the Yoshi's Island one way door. Mario 3 Ghost House, but before Mario Maker, so it's pretty cool, actually. This was the original Mario Maker. Don't at me. Also, I like how the boos have voices here. That's neat. I gotta get those coins. Crap, I missed one. Oh, key. Oh, 
Also, I'm pretty sure this is different than the Mario Advance 2 version of the song. Even though they could have just ported it. See? It's di oh, yeah, this wasn't... This wasn't in my level because, I mean, you can't do that. But, it is pretty cool. The freaking Mario World snake coin thing. It's basically a game of snake. Alright. Damn it, I forgot you needed to do that. Oh. Okay, good. The level doesn't, like, get screwed over. Oh yeah, this part was in there, though. I just couldn't do the other thing. I just put coins there automatically, I believe. Eww. Okay. I want to go that way. Yeah. They might be. And said sound clips are also reused from, like, other Mario games. I forget which ones, though. I think it's like the Mario 64 voice. I don't know. Bro, how am I supposed to do this? Bro! This is Mario 3. You can't just carry the P-Switch. How am I supposed to make it on time? There's no way. Oh, okay. We have to be real fast. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Also, another fun fact for you. Uh, Super Mario Advanced 1 was originally called Super Mario Brothers Deluxe 2. As evidenced by the Giga Leak. And, you know, that giant Nintendo Giga Leak that, like, archive that, like, showed a bunch of stuff, like the frickin' uncompressed Star Fox 64 voice clips, for example. Legendary. Um, how do I get here? Crap, I forget this level already. Oh wait, I think I know what to do. I wanna get that coin. Oh, I made a safe state. Thank God. Wait, did I go through this door? Oh, yeah, that's how I got here. Damn it. How do I get that coin? I went through all these doors, right? Can't think of a single door I haven't went in yet. No, well, this do be doors of plenty. Eh, well, whatever. I'll just beat the level. Oh yeah, no no boo boss fight in my level, because, you know, 
I can't do that, but this is pretty cool. It's like Mario World. What if you just run out of blocks? You're screwed. Da 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 da. I don't think I'll be able to beat this on this stream, honestly. But it was a good start. But, but oh, that's an airship level. I know that. Bombarded by Uba bombs. That was in my Mario Maker thing too. What the? Wait, what? That okay? I don't know what that thing is, but that's unique. Oh yeah, so I, I remember I was having difficulty getting the cannon speed. I had to use the fast one, which is faster than the max speed on the cannons in this game. So it was a little bit more difficult in my version of it. Mm -mm -mm. Well, I couldn't use the underground music in my version, so whatevs. Because you can't just use any music track, sadly. Wait, was that a coin block? In a question block? That's weird. Okay, didn't know about that. Damn it. Bro, they want me to get that number. Ah! Gosh, these levels are hard. I'll have to do this again next stream. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. My opinion still holds that I think 2D Sonic is funnier than 2D Mario, but I'm I'm not I'm still not gonna say that 2D Mario isn't fun because I like 2D Mario a lot as evidence for my many many hours of Mario Maker 2. I just get you know I just feel like Sonic's more accessible because you don't have to worry about getting hit all the time. It's always the most annoying thing for me when I'm playing these freaking Mario games. I'm just I lose my power up, and I'm like, ah, oh. and it's always just annoying. I hate the feeling of getting freaking power down in this. Ah, I got. At least with 3D Mario, you have like a health thing, which usually is pretty easy to just deal with. Oh, what the heck, hey there, doof! Hey there, Phaser. How you doing, everyone? Whoa. Hey there, Mordion. I'm playing some Mario Advance 4 World E over here. Because, you know, pretty cool and unique levels. Not in Mario's, not in the regular Mario 3. Whoa. How's everyone doing today? Oh, wow. That's pretty sick. Got that P5 grind going. What part are you on right now? Oh, wait. I think you probably... From what I remember, you had just seen, like, Futaba. 
for the first time. So I'm guessing you might have just finished her palace, maybe? I don't know. Or you're in her palace. Or maybe you're after that, I don't know. Or is that a spoiler? Crap, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, good. Oh, wow. Oh, thank you, Marnion. Okay, good. I didn't spoil anything. Oh, a Kumaras Palace. That one is pretty difficult, in a way. Be ready for that boss. That's all I'm gonna say. Also, a fun fact, the boss becomes easier on harder mode. Why? I don't know, but I, I just resorted to that because I thought it was too hard for me. I'm a little baby, I couldn't handle it. Okay, whoa. Whoa. This level's crazy. Okay. Okay, good, good. You're gonna go insane. <laughs> oh. No. Yeah. Persona 5 hell. Honestly, I'd say the Bang Palace is probably my second least favorite. Every other palace in the game is overall pretty solid. Overall pr pretty solid. Dang it, is there a way for me to get that mushroom without getting freaking babonged? No, apparently not. That's okay. I, I, I want to be able to get the secret anyway. Oh yeah, that's that's why. I was wondering, how is it easier? I just know you do more damage. I just, I didn't know about the weakness thing though. I'd always get like super close to like beating, getting to the end of the boss, but then I just run out of like stuff. Oh, wait. Is it like that in hard mode, like, normally, too? Because I don't know. Maybe it's like frickin' critical mode in Kingdom Hearts, where, like, you do more damage, but the enemies are stronger. Because I know that's how it is in K Kingdom Hearts. It's not like they just made every enemy stronger, and that was it. They're like, they also, like, buff your value, so that way it's more interesting. Ah, uh, damn it. Okay. This level's hard. Ah, uh, I see. Speaking of Kingdom Hearts, I'm gonna be playing at KH2 soon. I'm doing, uh, Mario Advance 4, and then versus Super Mario Brothers on the Switch, and then... Oh yeah, Mario 64... Crap, I don't want to go in there. Ah, I, I want to get the secret. And then go in the thing. Bro, these bombs are much more annoying than my Mario Maker 2 version. What happens? Somehow they're worse because they blow up so fast. Wait, okay, I was making sure I can do that. Okay, there's a secret here. Crap, I'm running out of time. Uh, yikes. I didn't know these were coin blocks, though. I don't think the map told me about that. It's just like, oh well, I guess. Okay, got all those. Boom, boom! Easy. I don't know what you get. I'm guessing you got one of those, like, special giant coin things. Well, it isn't marked on the map, so I don't actually know what happens. I'll, ha I'll, I'll look that up on the wiki. Speaking of which, I forgot to read the descriptions of the other levels. So, real quick, I'll just do that for fun. 
Um, okay, so run it. Uh, slide in the slopes. Run and slide all around. You'll even get to go upside down. You drink yourself while sliding down a hill. You'll fall headfirst into a valley. Vegetable volley. Pull up the vegetables and toss them at the enemy to succeed. Don't touch the blue poisonous mushrooms. It seems like this Mario guy doesn't realize that vegetables have uses other than defeating enemies. Yuck, 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 yuck. I think they're written in the, like... Because the coupling is on the card, so... It's written in their perspective in the Japanese ones. Travel through this puzzling maze. Beware of Big Boo. He'll confound you. Um, doors are plenty. Welcome to my fun home. Even if you throw a tantrum, nobody will come to help you. Oh my god. Bombarded by the bombs. Can you weather the storm of bomb blast and collect all the coins? You lot. Today's prey is Mr. Mario. Welcome him colorfully. Okay, um... Oh, next one is Magical Note Blocks. That one's in Mar That one's in my Mario Maker thing, too. Okay. I'd say this is easily one of the weakest world level levels, just judging by the, um, version I made. Wait, it looks like an ice level, almost. But, I wanted to keep the underground music still, so... Actually, for the first, like, the above ground part, I made it ice. Just because it's ice. They got a screen wrapping thing, which I wish you could have as a setting in Mario Maker, but you couldn't. So, I had to erase a couple blocks and just make room for that instead. I think this level's a lot funner here, because the no blocks don't feel weird, like in Mario Maker. I don't know. This level just feels better designed for this game, which, I mean, fair was made for this game. Also, the freaking Koopa shells bounce, like, super high off of no blocks in Mario Maker. Like, the properties of it, it's crazy. In this game, they kind of just bounce normally. So that's another reason this is better. But I did the best with what I had, so... It's all good. Oh yeah, and there's a chain chomp. Oh wait, no, that's a... Flame chomp. Oh yeah. Yeah, I had a chain chomp there. They don't have flame chomps. You'd think that would be a shoe-in for an enemy. Because, like, they had desert levels. Why not give them enemies? Why not put some enemies to put in there? Like the fire snake. And the flame chomp. I mean, they have the sun at least, but... Most of the stream is complaining about Mario Maker 2 and what they should have had in it. <laughs> but it's fine. Just think they should have supported it more, man. Oh, hey there, Phaser. What you working on? Oh, wait, are you making Mario Maker levels, too? Or, wait, maybe, like, a rum hack thing, I don't know. Like, Lunar Magic. Ah! Trying to get that coin. Okay, that was kind of crazy. I forget what I did to get that to be reachable. But the jump height is a little bit different. Ah, I see. Cool stuff, though. Can't wait to see it. Bro, I love the little flip he does. Oh, yeah, I forgot you did ROM hacks. I think I remember I was, like, testing a ROM hack, like, forever ago on, like, my phone. It was either yours or, like, Yoshi 2's or something. Yoshi 2 was cool. Been a while since I've talked to him. Um, oh, the old switcheroo. That one is not in Mario Maker 2. So, I forget why I didn't do this one. I think there was just too many... Oh yeah, there, I think there was like too many doors in this one. And it was just too big. That's why I didn't do it.
Maybe on another stream I'll play through those levels and advertise my Mario Maker 2 stuff, because, you know, that's a good idea. I could use my streams as a platform to advertise my Mario Maker levels. Good idea. I love shilling. Okay, um... I'm just gonna get a frickin' mushroom. I don't even remember what the last level was. True. I could also play viewer levels and stuff. But we'll see how that goes. Magical note blocks. Jump on the note blocks to reach towering heights. If you miss your step, you fall in the blink of an eye. The old switcheroo. Activate the hidden P switch so you can get all the coins. Hey, run Mario, run! If you hit your head, it'll be all be all over. Do do do. Do 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 do. Um. Where do I go? Oh. I guess I gotta go down here. Whoa! Do 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 do. Yeah, vertically, the level was too high. familiar with this one, so bear with me. Oh, they have a giant coin. Wait a minute. Ah. Wait. Crap. I gotta reset real quick. Hold up. Actually, I think I'll wrap up the stream here. Thank you all so much for watching the stream. If you like what you saw, feel free to follow and check out uh, my stream Discord server. Link is on the Discord side, I mean the Twitch sidebar thing. Oh crap. Um. Yeah. And um, I have an archive a YouTube channel where all the streams are archived. With the same channel name called uh yeah with has a lot of splatoon videos mario sonic games kirby games castlevania and kingdom hearts so yeah see you guys have yourselves a good one everybody